All right, everything should be set up. Theoretically, it should work, but uh, we'll find out. Never ran anything like this before, but I did quite a bit of research, so we've had her plugged in for an hour or so. Last time this baby ran was Christmas Day. So, no battery charger, and I've had the, that screen on, so. Hopefully she starts. It's only like the 13th of March, so it's only like two months, so. That's uh, something I forgot to do. Just file that screw down a little bit. When it's not engaged, but I can do that later. Just leaving a little scratch in there. Man, these windows are dirty as hell. Let's leave this open. Ensure the wheels are over the positions marked in the previous step. All right, then know I got to do that. Complete opposite way. Get 150 feet. I don't know if I got 150 
feet spare. Underneath a tree must have bad GPS. I put this on the steering wheel. There we go. <laughs> the knob was just spinning around. Alright, we're like 80 feet off. Holy cow, she's steering. We're a foot and a half off, getting closer. near a machine shed and a power pole. This is awesome. <laughs> set the aggressiveness for it to come back. I didn't think it was too bad, but it was a little slow. so freaking muddy so I only got this straightaway section here for the AV on.
know you can change it in the settings, so I don't once I get in the field I'll kind of know better when I'm actually doing tillage work. Online aggressiveness. I mean we'll just leave that for now. Free play offset. I don't need any offset. I can always go through and recalibrate. I feel like I need to be in the field actually doing stuff to calibrate this. But I just kind of want to play around with it. Boom. How many GPSs have we got? Eight satellites. I don't know if that's that good, but... Alright, we're going to do a free form. Because we ain't going to be using AB very, very much. New field. New pattern type, free form. I think that's going to be our go-to. Implement width. We'll do 10 feet. with this a while i'm sure this video is already long as hell so uh have some fun with it still learning all right i believe i got it figured out when i was doing it before i was setting a and b but on free form you need to use i don't know if you can see the little line thing to record your path you don't know, like unless you need to do an a b line you do that but since our fields are curving we use the curve so you just hit okay on it it'll turn green you drive to the other end of the field hit okay again and then you're done turn around drive i don't know just a little bit 
and then this button, I don't know if you can see, it'll turn yellow, and then you hit this and it'll engage in green. I'm offset two feet from my last pass. And also by that shed, once I did get it that way, it wouldn't work because I was doing like insanely sharp corners and uh, it couldn't keep on line, but they were damn sharp. So, so far it's holding true. I'm on the path to these back fields and it disengaged because I just went through a mud hole on this road. So, two foot paths kind of suck. set it where it doesn't disengage as easy because it gets off just a little bit and it's like you know what let's just disengage so I'm gonna go in the settings and see if I can find out yeah it's set to disengage at 10 inches and that is just really I can't go any more than that sucks change a few more things in the settings I just don't like how if it's off by 10 it disengages then again how often are you gonna be in the field going through a freaking mud hole so she's staying on and I got it set for three feet I feel like it'd be easier to engage when I'm doing like a chisel plow I don't know how many feet that is 13 or something, I don't know. But it is doing it. Learning curve. We're currently one inch off. Now we're off zero. So, not bad for lost signal. Up two inches now, one inch, zero. So, still need to tighten this wheel up because it'll spin just a hair. I just gotta loosen the wing nuts and slide it over about a quarter inch so it has a little more pressure. But, uh, wow. Ever since I changed, I don't remember what the heck I changed. Something sensitivity where if the wheel fights back, it'll disengage. I just changed that up quite a bit and uh, seems to help quite a bit. Kept it online at six and a half miles an hour. Let's see, let's go back this way. sure how good of a video it is or not it's probably longer than long but uh, I'm not gonna split it into two parts so. we are auto steering right now within two inches on was but we are on top of a hill and uh, nice catch y'all in the next video